We've given this title of Marketing Value Proposition, MVP. And Marketing Value Proposition is about being able to identify and communicate the unique role that marketing plays in your organization in driving the company's growth agenda. Okay? That's fundamentally what it is. And so that begs a number of questions. <laughs> number one is, what's your org's growth strategy? And I don't mean your marketing org, your company. What does it look like? Give me two lines, give me three bullet points. Tell me what your organization's growth strategy is. And that turns out to be a lot harder for most companies to articulate than it should be. And, and, and part of the reason I think is that um, someone said to me, I had a very great quote from a CMO. A CMO said, look, I know we need a growth strategy, but I don't think the old strategy models work anymore. I don't know how to think about strategy in this new world anymore. I remember Porter when I went to business school. <laughs> that ship has sailed. That doesn't work anymore. Yeah, we, need new we need a new framework to be able to make decisions. You show me what the options are, I can pick an option. If I don't know what the options are, it's really hard for me to articulate what my growth strategy is. So one of the first challenges that we had working on this stuff was giving people a framework to make choices about A, what their company's growth strategy was, and B, how the marketing org was going to uniquely contribute to delivering against that versus other functions or other pieces that were inside of the company. Right? So here's what the framework looks like that we built and we've now used with a whole bunch of companies. And this is kind of, this, the, kind of what we call the modern marketing org growth framework. And uh, you won't see things on here like pricing, you won't see things that are like a distribution, and I'm not saying four Ps don't matter, because they do, but we're looking at how does marketing contribute to growth in an organization in new ways and different ways than it did 20 years ago. Right? And so you'll see here, this is split three quadrants on the left and three on the right. Uh, on the left-hand side, this is about how does marketing contribute to delivering value to customers, and on the right-hand side, how does it deliver to uh, how does it contribute to delivering uh, value for the organization, right? So you can think about it as an internal kind of an external perspective. And, and you can't be great at everything. Uh, we have yet to come across uh, what we would call a three stack company, which is that they excel on all three of the customer value delivery side of the equation. Uh, we haven't found one yet. You have to make choices. That's the essence of growth strategy. It's the essence of all strategy. What you're going to do and what you're not going to do. And, and so what the kind of the mantra that we have in working with companies is uh, two majors, one minor. I'm an academic after all, right? Maximum number of things that you can really seek to be really good at and drive the needle and move the needle is three. Two majors, one minor. And, and, and at least one of those majors better be on the customer side, <laughs> right? The usually one, maybe a minor. And so two majors, one minor, right? That's the mantra.